Hello, my name is Aya Tugentegi and I'm the new head girl of Haley Brie Asana. Hello, my name is Sophia and I'm also the new head pupil of Haley Brie Astana. Why did you apply to become head pupil? So one of the main reasons I applied for the position is because leadership roles have been a huge part of my life, especially since joining Haley Brie Asana. This school has provided me with so many opportunities to show my best version of myself. And I hope that as head girl, I'll be able to help and listen to many other people around the school and make sure that people are comfortable with sharing their ideas. For me, I was really inspired by my experience as a house captain and getting to work very closely with the head pupil at the time. It inspired me to be that role model for younger students and hopefully inspire them to become future leaders in our school as well. How does it feel to be a member of the PLT? Is there anything you didn't expect that came with the position? Well, undoubtedly, I'm very happy to be fulfilling this position for the upcoming year. And I'm also very excited for all the new things that we could bring to the school and also the challenges that we might face. I'm honored that the students have chosen us um, to represent them and to represent their voice. And I hope that we can fulfill um, their dreams in this school as well. Well, of course, being head girl in any school is such an honorable position, and I am so grateful that all of the students at Haley Bree thought me and Sophie would be fit candidates for this role. It does mean a lot to us. And I think as head girl, there will be a few challenges along the way that may take us as a surprise, but I hope with all of the help from this amazing community, we'll be able to work through these together and make our school a better place for everyone. How can pupils contact you to share their ideas and ask questions? Well, undoubtedly, as head pupils, me and Sophia hope that every student feels comfortable to approach us in any corridor or outside of school, as of course our jobs do not just stop inside of school. And we also hope to introduce a student forum where our students will be able to collab with one another and be able to share their ideas in a comfortable space without any external influences. To continue what I was saying, um, I want to reiterate that every student is more than welcome to come up to us in the hallways, as personally I think being a leader means that you value your community more than anything and you value their voices and ideas because I think some of our best ideas come from the students. Um, and I would also like to say that even though I understand that certain students don't necessarily feel comfortable approaching us personally, you can always reach out to us through email and we are working on a Google form where you can anonymously or with your name upload your ideas and concerns regarding the school. What are your expectations for this year? So this year before the summer holidays, I would really like to prioritize inter-year group relationships and strengthening our community through various different events that Aya and I and the rest of the PLT uh, will be working hard to make happen for all of the student body. But as well, I would like to emphasize that I really want to focus on the year 13s as it is their last term here at our school Haleybury. And so I want to make it the best term possible for them. So as head pupils, me and Sophie, we really hope to strengthen this scholarly community. Community is the heart of the school and we hope that we can do anything in our power to make all of the events and preparations that everybody has so desperately wanted throughout the past few years and making those actually happen in our school. As well as that, me and Zofia really want to introduce a spirit week where every single day of the week, students will be encouraged to dress in a specific theme to show school unity and spirit. This would be one of our major working points for the school year and we really hope that we can make this a possibility for everybody in our school. What initiatives would you like to implement at school? Intercommunal relationships is going to be our main priority as head pupils as we feel like there has been a huge disconnect after the recent pandemic. Because of this, we want to be able to engage all of these different year groups to reap the most benefits we can from this school year and make it a year that everybody can remember. I think as well, um, I, we would like to focus on more student-led activities here at school as it would really benefit the leadership skills that the school emphasizes on developing in students. For example, more student-led assemblies and varied assemblies, which could be interactive as well, would really help start the day off right in our community. And as well, we would like to prioritize a buddy system where older pupils could mentor younger pupils, possibly entering senior school, which could also create those unforgettable bonds that make school such a special place for all of us. Exactly. And Zofia said it perfectly, but we want to make sure that all of your voices are heard. You all have a voice and so many incredible ideas that as head pupils, we hope that we can drive your encouragement, your enthusiasm and your inspiration to their absolute highest potential because that is what you deserve as a community. 
With that being said, this was our very brief introduction, but we would love to get to know every member of our community even more and develop those relationships amongst the students that make Haleybury such a special place. And we look forward to working with each and every one of you over the next academic year. And we can't wait for everything that is to come in Haleybury. As we said earlier, we are so honored that you guys provided us with such an incredible opportunity. And because of that, we hope to provide you with many more amazing ones to come. Me and Sophia are gonna try our best to make Haleybury Aston the most memorable place during our time as head pupils. And like she said before, we hope that you can come up to us at any time convenient for you. Thank you. Bye guys. Bye.